Important note. I'll probably be very critical when it comes to faults or something of the like showing up in a game. I also won't be able to play mods based on the Sonic games available on Steam since, as of now, I don't own any of them. I've also picked games based on if it's something I'm interested in or outright no I'll probably like. Please don't be discouraged if your game doesn't end up appearing. There are others that'll probably like that game, but I'm just not one of them. My taste in games can be seen as all over the place and very different from others. Please understand. Each game will have its maker talked about and their name pop up on screen. Also, the games will be linked in the description. Each video will show off two or three games. That's all for this notice. Please enjoy the video. Okay, next up is Delta Gal. Nick Delta Gal. Delta Gal is inspired by Mega Man Legends, made by author Vi 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 Viter. Author Viter. And for some weird reason, OBS does not like capturing this game's window, so I have to use this, the computer display capture in order for it to actually show up on screen. That's kind of unfortunate. Don't know why. I've tried game capture, it didn't work. Tried window capture, it didn't work. So I have to use the display capture, so this is going to look a bit weird. Anyway, this is inspired by Mega Man Legends, as you can clearly tell. I'm going to be honest, I got decently far, I think, in Mega Man Legends, the Nintendo 64 version. But I don't, but I didn't actually ever beat the game. Got all the running at least moving about. Hmm. Where can I go? Can I talk to you? Hey, 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 hey. It's possible to jump high enough. You're not just holding the button, duh. There we go, now I'm running. Bonk. Gear shop, so I'm guessing that's where I can go. Yep. Don't got anything. It's a calendar, but it's like 15 years old. Playing screaming, he's playing screaming game. Oh, bye. We have stuff. Peace. Why can I not talk to you then? Get, get, Hello. Get, get. Sorry, but we don't sell the type of items you need. Get gear shop next door instead. Hmm. Skim milk or buttermilk? Ah. Oh, here we go. What's this? Oh. Town celebrated oh. right now. What are you even doing? Ah. Hmm. Restaurant. Nope, can't go in there. That's where it came from. Can't go in there. Ah. Okay, what? 
Oh my goodness, you can do that, really? Yep, seems legit. Train? Start off, save game. I can go back in here, apparently. someplace else something tells me I wasn't supposed to go down here oh I can swim never mind and I better hurry cuz I'm drowning Okay, I'm just hold the button down. This is really unfortunate. Chris, no real good way to tell how to get back up. Oh, hello. There we go. There we go. Now I'm moving on. I'm guessing this is just that there's no real, like, dungeon or anything, it seems. Slide button. Yep, I slid under here, okay. I can just barely get up there. I guess there's just two worlds examples and an area just mess with shooting and stuff. So there's nothing really much this demo, it's just a short example thing, I'm guessing. Maybe I just didn't explore thoroughly enough. I'm going to go, and go take one more quick look. Hey, hey, hey. This is Rock Guy, who is in a junkyard. Hey, hey, just head to the kid far side of the forest to find him. Ah. Oh, hello, what's that over there? Fly moral victory. Okay, there's probably an NPC there. Except they're gonna have to get in through here, which the game doesn't allow me. Huh. Also, I'm almost dead. Hello. Aha, so there is something. Doesn't help that I'm low on HP right now, though. Blades, oh no. Guess I go in here.
Aha! Did you have enemy stuff? <laughs> Game over. Good job. Okay, so there is some dungeon stuff here. I'm actually just going to call the demo here for now, actually. If you guys want to explore that dungeon, you can go ahead and download the game. Yeah, I can I can definitely see the potential in this. It does definitely feel like Mega Man Legends. Just with a female character protagonist. Anyway, on to the next game. Time for this next game. Um, David Keen. You can, tell, you can tell by the old, like, TV style. This is going to be interesting. David... David Keen, or Dave, David Keen, David Get Keen is a super fast 3D platformer with old school aesthetics. I can tell. You must speed through tough as nails platforming tasks all the way to the end goal. Uh oh. I'm probably going to fail horribly then. You'll be great on your efforts. Yeah, I'm failing horribly. This demo contains two levels, made by Jazzy Man Studios. Okay, time to fail at video games. Play demo. Aperture Void. You are now entering the void. To launch by the Trail of Limits. Okay. Interesting. Use your dash, dash to scale walls. You can use dash in the air to extend your jump. Oh, it wants me to go up there, okay. What? Hmm. Okay, yeah, this is gonna be difficult to get used to. This feels very weird. Okay, we're gonna ignore that for now. Wait, now that I'm dashing, can I just... Hmm. Interesting. Oh. oh no, everything. Oh, it's instant death. Oh no. You can try to with the spin, right mouse button, or B with a homing attack. Space or A while airborne, okay. lagged for some reason yep yeah this is gonna be difficult for me to do <laughs> yeah going slower seems better you can use the stop last button to quickly hit the ground Oh my 
goodness. Why is there so much lag appearing on for this game? Those enemies aren't coming back, are they? like that, which is annoying. Is it literally just to collect all that and that's it? I guess this is like the demo testing area and there's an actual level, but yeah, I'm actually done with this for now. Yeah, I can tell this is... Like, it's like Sonic, but like more... Hmm. Huh. Makes me think more I want to be the guy since the game... <laughs> it did warn you that it was going to be n tough as nails platforming, so they were right about that. Anyway, I do like the art style, though. The art style is actually really, really nice. Anyway, that's all for this one. On to the next game. Okay, next up is Dream Dream Dasher. Dream Dasher is a hand-drawn 2D platformer all about momentum. Form crazy maneuvers and soar from one enemy to another. Made by Wearneck. Let's check the options and controls. Up down the left right, Z to jump, X to dash. Let's change that real quick. Because of my keyboard thing. Other worlds that it picks randomly. Okay. Anyway, I gotta go from world one through sixteen. Now you can do all, all of them. I'm just gonna do do a couple of these. Butterfly. color just disappeared uh, it's death had a smile face on it what I'm definitely getting some Kirby vibes from this Thank you. 
Oh, okay. You can actually aim... Upper de you can actually aim your... Um... Dashing. This already one, two. Ow. And there's ranks, nice. Ow. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna try something. Okay, you can do this real quick. Oh. Been janky. Nothing too bad. A Thirteen combo, apparently. Oh, that's all oh, the enemies I kill. Okay, nice. Really nice for a second there. Ow. Swinging on vines, swinging on vines, hitting the thorns and dying. There we go, that was... Ugh, man. Not fully used to the extreme momentum. Yeah, B rank now. Oh! Uh, I think I'm at a boss. Ow. I took to him during the first fight carried over I think which is weird um yeah the entire stage of that is complete
I wonder, can this be cheese? 